press just the deglossing. I also sanded it just a little bit. Well, I was looking for my sanding. <laughs> I don't know, somewhere. So I also sanded the chair with this, and I just went around it really not carefully at all. I was just giving it a little bit of texture before I was going to degloss it just to help get off because, you know, I can see and I showed you what the cloth looks like. Um, it is so much more heavily stained than my cabinets were. My cabinets really just kind of had a, a finish on them, um, a protective layer. This rocking chair really had a lot of dark walnut kind of staining to it. Um, and it needed a lot of scrubbing. So I used a lot of deglosser. Yeah. Um, but I just sanded it just a little bit to prep it. So I'm just using the same metallic in a rich, shiny finish, fast drawing, copper color that I used for the handles on my cabinet project. Now I suspect this chair is going to take more than one of these, so I'm going to suspect that I have to go out and buy a second one. But we're going to see. Um, but so far, you know, it's just going to be a little accent chair in the living room. We'll see how it goes. Sweet Pea, I'm coming. You have to give Mama one second. Be a friend. I'm coming. Hold on, my darling. He's my number one helper. Oh. Whoa, careful. Oh. Whoa, careful, my love. Oh. So you're just going to have to excuse the projects in the back and the construction equipment, but you can see what it looks like. It's really nice and subtle. No. 